Hello and welcome back to SAP S4HANA Asset Management Training. We are still exploring the Fiori Launchpad and this time I'm going to do a second video on how to work with the Post Good Movement app. So I'll go ahead and click on the app. That gets us to the Goods Issue screen. On this screen I'm going to select Other. Then I'll scroll down to the bottom section. Now I need to work with these three tabs here, material, quantity, and where. So I'll enter the material number that I'm looking for or I want to issue. It's a casing. Then from there, I'll select quantity and that's going to be one, a unit uh, quantity. And then I need to look for the, or enter the quantity of measure. And in my case, it's going to be pieces. So PC, and then click OK. So from here, I need to go to the next tab, which is where. This is where that material is used. So I'll click on that tab. And here you can see there are several, several fields that need to be populated. We have the movement type, we have plant, storage, location. We have goods recipient, unloading point, and also the long text. So I'm just going to populate three values that I have. Then I need to go to account assignment. And all I need to do here is to enter the cost center number. If I don't have the cost center number, I can go ahead and search for rate. And on this screen, we have several filters. I could search by controlling area, company code, cost center category, or even short text. So, but in my case, I have the cost center number. So I will go ahead and enter that number in this field. So my cost center number is, um, 4300. So I'll go ahead and type that in and then I can post the goods. So I have an error here which says I'm missing the order number. So I need to navigate back. So I'll accept that log and scrolling down, I can see, yeah, the order number is missing. So I'll go ahead and populate that order number. That is 4,168. It's an order number that we had created earlier. So once that is done, I can go ahead and post the goods and that should go through. And now you can see we have that material has been issued. I'm gonna scroll up here in a second. And you can see the document date, the posting date, and you can see that material, uh, the quantity and all that information. So that is how we work with post goods issue. Thank you for watching and please remember to subscribe to our channel and see you in the next video.